Hey guys, this video is sponsored by Display. Display makes beautiful metal posters like this one right here, which of course is Starry Night, my favorite painting by my favorite artist, Vincent Van Gogh. Uh, so I had to get a poster of it and they are completely made out of, out of metal. Listen to this, ready? High quality metal. This is, I mean seriously, super high quality. And look at this, when you buy these, you save the trees because you're not buying paper posters. You are buying metal posters, which are 100% recyclable. So these posters are gonna last a long time. Why? Well, because you don't have to put holes in them anymore to put them up on the wall. There's no more folding and wrinkles and the poster getting old. This will last forever. Now, if you for some reason get sick of uh, this painting and you're like, I don't want this on my wall anymore, all you gotta do is put in the recycling bin, and it's 100% recycling, uh, recyclable. <laughs> uh, also, it's super easy to put on. Uh, so when you order these mag, or the posters, they come with magnets, uh, which you just simply, you know, slap on and you put it on your wall. It's really simple, really simple stuff. So uh, they are really, it's a genius idea. I love these high quality posters. And they're really awesome. They've got a wide variety of different uh, art styles. Like you got art art, uh, you've got movie art, you've got maps you can uh, uh, get, you can get video game art, which you can see in the back of my wall there. I got some Kingdom Come stuff. So there's a lot of awesome different styles you can get on their website. Uh, I just, I got a couple new posters I wanted to show you guys really quick. So this is a poster from one of my most favorite movies, Monty Python and the Holy Grail. You got the Black Knight, uh, None Shall Pass, Just a Flesh Wound. I really love this one. I love the style of it. And for the, my last poster, I've got a poster of my boyfriend here. Oh yeah, Napoleon. He's going to look great on my wall. So definitely check out their website, guys. There is a big sale going on right now till the 2nd of January where you can get 31% off. All you have to do is add a poster to your cart and you will see that discount. Uh, so again, only until January 2nd. I know the holiday season's over, but maybe, you know, maybe you didn't get something you wanted to get or, you know, you want to, you know, treat yourself or maybe you want to get another gift for someone even though the holiday season's over. This is a good opportunity. So 31% off till January 2nd. Check out their website linked down below and enjoy the video, guys. All right, guys, what's up? It's Apollo here, and welcome back to the Thrones of Britannia Let's Play. We are uh, really close to the end, really close. We just got a couple more wars, a couple more settlements, but so far it's been a cakewalk. We have we have everything under control, and England is about to be created. It's going to be exciting times. Um, we have a lot of armies to upgrade. Look at this. Look at this. They force us to do one at a time. I'm not sure why they do. Uh, but yeah. Get these guys quickly upgraded. And we are about to declare war on the house faction. And it should be a fairly quick war. They... I don't even see an army from them. But yeah, this army is still making their way. A couple more turns and they'll be in position. They've got to go, mm, they've got to go pretty far. I could get them to just go down this way. This would actually be somewhat quicker. So we're going to do that instead, actually. Um, this army's headed back to their city to replenish. Okay, I think we can declare war pretty soon. This city's very upset, but as soon as we get this army back in there, they're going to be fine. Let's end the turn, and we've pretty much defeated East Anglia. I'll let my vassals deal with them. I mean, you know what I'll actually do? Oh, beautiful. We got another vassal army there. Kent, where the hell are they going? I don't know, but bless their heart. Kent is the most useless vassal out of all of them. Here comes a fi five-stack army, which is a bit annoying. But they're doing what they got to do. Riots. Oh, no. Okay, that's fine. Here comes the army to tame the people. Establish order peacefully. Okay. We got to rebuild everything. Because these ungrateful people don't realize how good they got it. And then, 
Now we declare war. And this is for pretty much all of England. Pretty close to it. But let's get this army going. Okay, you guys ready? This is definitely going to blindside them, but... Here we go! Oh, they have an ally. Will they join the fight, though? No, they will not! Because we're too powerful. They're like, look, they just want to form England, okay? We don't care. Uh, we can build over here. Look at this. We can improve some buildings. Alright, this army go over here. Quite so. Oh. We did it? True power comes at the point of a sword. With your mighty army, you have dominated. Crushing those who oppose your rule. Hell yeah. Now you are the true power in these lands. All thrones bow to your rule. Hell yeah. Reform England? Oh, we just did a short conquest victory. Nice. Um. That's cool. Hell yeah, guys. Uh, but we didn't form England. Which we need to do. What, we, what do we have to do to, to do this? Like, take a certain amount of regions? We're going to continue, though. We Short victory conquest. Awesome. But it's not what I wanted to do. We want to... We want to... The short kingdom victory. You know, that's what we want to do. Once we do that, then we'll call it. But sweet, we we finished one of the objectives. That's that's awesome. That's really cool. Okay, so the armies are moving over here. We could move this army and just take out all these. Yeah, we'll do that. So we'll take out this, this, and then this. That'll be pretty sweet. We will do our this army, we could actually recruit more soldiers into it. Just to make them a little stronger. Very nice. And also help with the uh, people being upset. We're negative four in food though, so you know what? <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> Hopefully that changes soon. I mean, we, we keep taking territory, which are giving us more and more food. The men have trained for this. But yeah, I think we got research available. Let's improve the spearmen. Food shortage, yeah. I don't know. We await your you know what? Maybe, maybe not. We're gonna disband some of the units here. We'll do one more unit. Go back to farming. I have too many armies, I guess. See, this is, it's just tough. It's it's tough having a lot of armies. Okay. I think we're good, so we're gonna end the turn. End the turn, keep up our conquest. Oh, beautiful. Good job, Mercia. Oh, we need to check on our vassals. That's the last thing we need to do. Like, we're near a victory and then the vassals just riot and we gotta kill all of them or something, you know? And we might even win the campaign here, which would be pretty sweet. Um, I really enjoyed this, and I think what I'm gonna do... Uh, I'll, I'll talk about it later. I'll talk about it, because it's not relating to this, so... Uh, so let's keep on going. All forces in good order. Let battle commence. Keep on taking. For all Anglican, glory awaits us. 
Okay, and then the army over here. Going through friendly territory. Makes, makes them much faster. Yeah, we're doing great. We're we doing great. We're might we're zero food though. So you know what? Let's just disband another unit. Go back to work. There we go. Seven food. Alright, send the turn. Oh yeah, take it, Mercia. Why don't you take it? They suck at taking door. Oh look at this. Are you serious? Yes! Good job, Kent. They actually did something useful. Now that we have taken that settlement, we could actually go for peace. Because we've taken all the regions now that we need from them, right? Like, we don't need to take this settlement up here. We just need this settlement. And then we need this. Oh, this is really good. Somehow, maybe this little house settlement did go to war and they took this settlement over here. That's the settlement we, so we don't need, well, uh, yeah, I don't think we need to go to war with this bull faction anymore because they lost this province. It's pretty sweet. We, okay, let's get out of this. What do we still need from North? Oh, okay. We just need to take this settle this this region right here. I'll clean out these settlements. Move down south. Take out these guys. We're gonna look good. Looking real good. Alright, let's take you out. Taking out all these swamp cities. We await your command. Oops, no, 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 no. Leave none that alive. Oof, that was close. We shall. We shall. And we will. Drayton. Alright, and then we're gonna move and start taking these regions. We need this, 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 and we're good. We win. We will do our utmost. Okay. Alright, let's send the turn again. Nobody's rebelling anymore. That's good. Food is going up. It's great. Good times. Good times. I guess we could have negotiated peace, but... Oh, we took it. We took door. Look at, look at Kent go. Sending armies by sea. What is this army? No, they sent their army up north. These fools. Our ally, which ally? Our ally has a rightful claim to the region of... Which, what ally though? I don't know. Who? Who claimed it? I wish it would tell us. I swear to God, if it's the bull faction, I'm going to be so mad. It is. Whatever. We don't need it. I don't think we need it. We just need these regions. Look, they can have it. But I'm going through their lands. Oh, they took all of this region back. They didn't just take one province, they took all of it. The Oops. I should have said no. Wow. They better freaking love us. But we don't need this, right? We don't need that territory to get the objective. No, we don't. So that doesn't take away anything. If anything, that makes them happy. We just need to take this. We need to beat them to that. All forces in good order. Ready and eager. My vassals are kicking. But the men have trained for this. Kicking butt. Yeah, our armies are stuck in the marshes, which is kind of annoying. We await your commands. 
You know what? I'm not even gonna attack this city. I'm gonna go for this city. Onwards to victory. I need it. Need it. Food shortage. Whoa! Because we lost all those cities. Because I'm an idiot. We will do our utmost. Damn it. I shouldn't have given it to him. That was so dumb of me. It's our offer of peace, and you will suffer. Um, they want a peace treaty? No. No peace. But no peace for the wicked bastard. I mean, he's the one who declared war on us. Bastard. Winter's almost over. Woo, there we go. Double down. Okay. Now that winter's over. Oh, God, the marshes, man. Slowing down my army so much. We will prevail. So I got my two armies moving in. You know what? what if I go by sea? Yeah, we need to go by sea. And just uh, land over here. Walk. Just get past the marshes. The men have trained for this. Can I take this? Yes. We shall. Hopefully that helps. Yeah, there's a farm right there. That helps a lot. Cool. Cool, cool. And uh, three, we're three settlements away from winning this campaign, guys. Nice. Do our utmost. Get new research. Plus one unit food upkeep. That's not good. What should we do? Let's improve the bodyguards of the generals. Why not? Alright, let's end the turn. Yeah, so... What I was going to say earlier, and I was like, I'll tell you later. I might as well tell you now. So, I think what I'm going to do is Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I'm going to stream a campaign... And then the days in between that, I'm going to upload battles. Because I've been streaming that French campaign. And it's been really fun. And a ton of people have been watching. So that tells me that people are hyped up for it. So that's that's really cool. Like, I don't know. I just, I do enjoy streaming those and like interacting live. Like, it makes campaigns much more enjoyable, I guess. I mean, I'm having fun with this. Don't get me wrong. But, yeah. Cool stuff. Um, I could move this army up and take this region. But I don't feel like it. And I'd rather this army go down south. I mean, this army isn't really needed anymore. Like, we just don't need them. So we're going to go after these armies. All forces in good order. Cool. And then... The men have trained for this. Longboats. God, there we go. There we go. Alright, that's that should speed it up a little bit. Let's take this region right here. Let's occupy that. And pretty soon, guys, we're going to have ourselves a small kingdom victory. Cool. More farms, too. That's, that's definitely needed. Definitely needed. Oh. Let's build here. Here we go. We're almost at a hundred thousand gold. Because we just have so much gold. Alright, let's end the turn. So yeah. They want a peace treaty, huh? Um sure. You are not We're at peace now. They have a settlement way up there. I don't care about that settlement anymore. East Anglia, they can do whatever they want. Oh, they're going for that settlement. I like it. Vassals, man. They're doing stuff. Oh, he better not. Oh, my God. What? So annoying. So annoying. 
keep the region. I'm not giving. A, I'm not giving back any land. Moving up. I'm gonna go kill that army. Bastards. Our navy is prepared. All right. All Let's get this army going. All forces in good order. Let's battle commence. All right. We're so close to a victory here, guys. So close. It's gonna be great. We are ready. Okay, let's um, end the turn. I think uh, a couple more turns here, and we're gonna be fine. Look at my vassals help chasing down this enemy force. Let's see what he does here. Is he gonna run? Is he gonna keep going after undefended minor settlements? A contribution to our coffers would be appreciated. Holy crap! They're demanding a thousand gold. Um, I'm gonna say no. Oh my god, he is gonna do that. He's just gonna keep running. So annoying. So annoying. Okay, well, let's... This is definitely gonna slow down our victory here. The men have trained for this. Take back the city. Then we're gonna have to move this army over here. Try to stop them. Ships ready to sail. Nice. You guys are gonna attack that city. We will prevail. Beautiful. But beautiful. Just one more city. I mean, we got to take back these, but one more city. Let's give them quartermaster. Make it faster, cover more ground. Risk of rebellion. Oh my god, this city. That's annoying, but it's fine. Send the turn and win this campaign. We will do it, what is this, the 12th episode? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Accept a truce to save your people more pain. Uh, absolutely not. I will try not to take it. I will accept peace. <laughs> he lost. He lost to a tiny army. What an idiot. I'll accept peace once I have my cities back. No. I'm not giving regions away that I worked hard to get. The men are ready to serve. Ready and eager. Glory awaits us. All right. To glorious King King siege. King's army is about to get there. All forces in good All right. The good news is we can return this march. army back. We don't need them anymore because this army is about to be destroyed. We can auto resolve. Get the hell out of my land. Stab him in the foot, chop his head off. There you go. <laughs> um, kill the captives. We await your commands. Yes. Now I will negotiate peace. Because I don't need to take your lands anymore. I hope you will not try my patience today. May I not live? Sure, I could have gotten money out of them, but I don't need the money. Do Look at all this money I have. Almost at a hundred thousand gold. Attack the foe. The men are ready to Okay. Serve. Guess what, guys? One more turn. Uno more turn, and we are gonna be victorious it's gonna be pretty sweet pretty pretty sweet we're positive here with food uh oh <laughs> he's attacking the territory I gave away okay oh, this is exciting All forces in good order. here we go the glorious combat And 
We have formed England, I think. I'm pretty sure. A short kingdom victory. Your faction. Yes, your faction is now called Anglo Saxons. We have uh, finally. Beautiful. We're now called the Anglo Saxons, boys. Alright, so that's. That's gonna be the, the campaign, guys. So. We accomplished quite a lot. We've accomplished a short conquest victory and a short kingdom victory. Almost have. A short fame victory but I always wanted to keep this campaign short it was really just a placeholder here until to get through the holidays and whatnot um, but the holidays are almost over and uh, I think by the time this campaign all the episodes are posted there might be a couple days where I don't upload because I did finish this campaign a little too early but uh, yeah uh, I think the next time I play this campaign with this mod I'm gonna play as like a really small I think I'll do like Northumbria because they're a really small faction it was really easy with um, Wessex but again this was us diving into the new mod which I think is really cool really awesome mod and uh, really fun so definitely give out the um, shield wall mod a try thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this campaign you guys said I wouldn't finish it well I finished two objectives okay so that's going to wrap it up here today, guys. Thank you so much for watching this. Those who watched every single episode, thank you so much. It was a lot of fun. And remember, I'm going to be streaming in the New Year's. Once the New Year's, New Year's start, I'm going to be streaming Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I'll do a live campaign. So check it out. Hang out with me. And then in between those days, I'm going to be doing battles. So I think it's a pretty cool, pretty good, cool mix. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time on the battlefield. Thank you.